Joe, we got a Christmas card. We did. From Pork and Good. We also got a box from them. It showed up at our door on our way out while we were going camping. So I brought it with us. Hey, what's up family? I'm Rachel. And I'm Joe. And we are Two, Two Crazy, Crazy Ketos. Ketos. And if you're new to our channel, welcome. Here on Two Crazy Ketos, we do different things like recipe videos and we do product reviews and we talk about various keto topics. And then every Monday, we sit down on the couch for Keto on the Couch. We just kind of talk about what's going on in our lives for the week. You can find us on different social media platforms like Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And we have a website, which is twocrazyketos.com. And that's where you're going to find all of our different recipes. Now we do upload at least five new videos every single week, so make sure you subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to hit the little bell icon and that way every single time we upload a new video, you'll be alerted to You're it. You're on the wrong side. I know, I'm like, I'm, I'm on opposite day right now. You are. But it's okay, because so we're camping. we got this box in the mail. Nice little Christmas card. Yes, it's so sweet with a pig on it, And uh, of there, course. There is a bunch of pork rinds in here. But that's not all that's but in there. But what I'm really excited about, because like nacho cheddar, I just dropped everything. It's nacho cheddar. And white cheddar. We love all these flavors. And salt and vinegar. Is there a dill pickle in there? And sour cream and onion. And pepperoni pizza. But is there a dill pickle in there? And what else is this one? Salted butter. This tastes like butter and popcorn. Butter popcorn. And no, there is no dill pickle. Oh, wait. Wait, 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 there you go. Okay, thank goodness. Dill pickle. Because that's my fave. That is your favorite. Although the salted, salt and vinegar one is really good too. But, you know what else is in here? What? A new flavor. Smoky jalapeno and cheddar. And if you're new to our channel, I am all about the jalapeno. Yes. Anything jalapeno. Fit. Our first date, Rachel looked at me because I ordered a burger. With a lot of jalapenos with on jalapenos it. jalapenos and then a wing sauce on top. I was like, I want a side of a jalapenos and a lot of them. That's, I like anything with jalapeno in it. That's Joe in a burger, jalapenos and wing sauce. That's right. So we've got a smoky jalapeno and cheese flavor and They've got seasonings now. They've got se they actually have four different flavors, but this they sent us one. two of them. So they have this one here, the smoky jalapeno and cheese seasoning. And then we have the dill pickle seasoning. With a little tag that says, tis the seasonings. Now I don't How have my glasses, that? so you're gonna have to read the ingredients on that, but do I you wanna help. try these? Yes, I do. Okay, let's start off with these. You know we're breaking like a 48 hour fast. With, with pork, pork rinds, rind. which we would not like tell other people to do. No. <laughs> well, at least it's fat. Mmm. Oh god, wow. that's my new favorite flavor. Wow. That is nice. That is good. It's got a tongue kick. The 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 spice is on your tongue. But that jalapeno, like jalapeno in itself is a really good flavor. It's got a great flavor and all of the the heat actually comes from the seeds, but that is phenomenal. Wow, that, that is, is very really, like buttery. Really, really good. That is okay, nice. Okay, you want to try these seasonings? Yes, I do. Well, we just kind of tried that seasoning, but we have the dill pickle seasoning. Let's do it. Because I want to put these on all of the chicken wings we make at home. I could have sworn I brought a spoon out here. I there see we it. Go. Hiding underneath pork rinds. <laughs> yes. That is action packed. Wow. Wow. I'm thinking like on top of wings. Like make yes. our wings in the oven or in an air fryer. And then toss them in that. Wow. Oh my gosh. I really want to go in for this now. Oh my gosh. Because I thought that I liked the dill pickle before. But I mean, I want to put that on top of a burger. Don't you want to put that on top oh, of a burger? Yes. You don't even need pickles on your burger. You just season it with that. We're probably having way too much here too. Wow. What a smoky flavor. Wow. You really like taste the smokiness. Wow. That'll open my nose your nose. Run. Yep. Wow. Let's have a little drink. 
Woo! You wanna do five things? Five things. Five things. So if you're new to our channel, we review all products based on five things. We're gonna talk about the ingredients. Does the keto based on a nutrition label? How does it taste? How much does it cost? And finally, would we recommend it? I need a drink. I'm gonna have to borrow some of your drink. Okay, let's start off mine. real quick. It's number like one, the ingredients. Empty. Pork rinds, uh, cooked in pork fat. That's very That's important the best. to me. Seasoning, which is white cheddar, cheddar cheese, milk, salt, uh, cheese cultures, enzymes, whey, buttermilk, natural flavors, salt, disodium phosphate, silicon dioxide, which is added as an anti-caking agent, then we have salt, non-fat, dry milk, onion powder, dehydrated jalapeno, spices including paprika, lactic acid, smoke oil, which is soybean oil and smoke flavor, and then artificial green bell flavoring. So white cheddar is the cheese. So white cheddar is the cheese, Neat. and then the ingredients are very good. There's no maltodextrin in here or anything like that. And as far as that soybean oil, I'm fine with that. That is like the second last ingredient and it's part of the, the actual spices. spice flavor. It's just yeah. how they're making the smoke flavor. Right. So I'm really good with that. Um, so that's gonna be the same ingredients that's on here. And then we have the dill pickle. Yeah, it's the same except for obviously there's no pork rinds. Right. So the dill pickle uh, seasoning is just salt, sodium diacetate, spice extratives, and dill weed. Awesome ingredients. Number two, does a keto based on a nutrition label. We gotta look at the pork rinds first. Okay, so the pork rinds are, there's four servings of pork rinds there's in two. a bag. <laughs> 80 calories per serving, five grams of fat, eight grams of protein, zero total carbs. Yep. And zero fiber, obviously, so yeah. And I, I would say it says zero total carbs, but figure there's like the a half a carb per serving. So I would say if you eat the whole bag, you're probably looking at about two carbs just because of the way that they're allowed to round down. But all of these spices definitely have some carbs in it. So this is what I'm most interested in and that is what is a serving size? <laughs> A pr it's supposed to be. I haven't looked, but I'm going to anticipate it's a quarter of a teaspoon. It's a quarter of a teaspoon. Every spice. So, and that's going to be three calories, zero grams of fat, zero grams of protein, and zero total carbs. But I would, again, I would just go like with one. Yeah, a one or even a half. If it per says serving. zero, I say, it's, I always say, if be you safe. round it to a half, you're good. If you say that there's a half, so if you have, because none of us are going to use a half of serving, we're going to use a double serving. Yes, because this is so delicious and takes us to number three. Which is? How does it taste? And they all taste delicious. You're gonna wanna sprinkle everything with this. I wanna get the other flavors of this. I don't remember what they are. I'm gonna put a list of what they are right down here on the bottom, but I'm yeah, excited. I'm thinking like, I mean, obviously we don't do popcorn anymore, but on top of a burger, on Burgers. top of wings, like if you wanna yes. make wings, if you wanna- Chicken. Like, yeah, like get a chicken, put it in your air fryer, put this on the skin and have that nice seasoning and just great ingredients. I you, love it. You know what I'm doing with this? What? Adding it to my deviled eggs. Oh, yeah. Because delicious. Yeah. Like, this would be super good. And again, you've got, it's gluten-free, no sugar, no MSG, and no maltodextrin. I love it. It's great. Number four, how much do they cost? I almost don't even care because they're so good, I just want them. Uh, these, I don't remember. I didn't even bother looking at the price. It's the normal price. It's like $13 or something like that for four bags. You buy it in a case, and they have the small and the large bags. This is what this I is really what I care about. <laughs> so the price on these are $8.95, which I actually do not think is that bad. I mean, no. seasonings and spices are expensive. Well, and I mean, this is really going to transform a lot of different recipes. I mean, I'm putting it on salads, and I'm putting it on fish, and I'm going to put it in, like, I'm going to put it in my tuna fish. Can you imagine how good it would be, oh, the dill gosh, pickle yes. with the tuna fish? Yeah. And it's going to go a long way. So they have four different flavors. They have this uh, smoky jalapeno and cheese. They have the dill pickle. I know they have the, the Himalayan pink salt, but there was one more. I don't remember what it was. Yeah, I'm not sure. Put it down below. I'll put it down there on the bottom. So, But overall, $8.95 isn't that bad. Now, we are not affiliates with them. We, we just don't like make it. any money off. We just really like their product. But we do have a coupon code. We've asked them in the past for a coupon code. It's two crazy ketos, and it will get you 10% off when you order directly from their website. That'll help out. Number five, would we recommend these? Heck yes, it is delicious. I don't think that you're going to have to use a ton of it. I honestly, the, the what we put on the spoon was way too way much. Way too much. Like and that I was probably a it. serving. I probably would say that it was about a quarter of a teaspoon on the spoon. But so. it's it's really going to make you know recipes taste really good. And I'm very excited about the dill pickle because I can almost overdo it with pickles because I just love pickle flavor. Right. And the fact that I can just take the pickles out of it altogether and still 
get like a very intense pickle flavor. I'm gonna be using this a lot for hamburgers. I'm thinking it's gonna elevate your burgers. It's gonna elevate your eggs. You can put it on so many different things. Highly recommend this. And like always, we highly recommend Chicken. the pork rinds. If you like jalapeno, this new flavor is phenomenal. But it's not as hot as spicy. Um, no like stupid sp stupid hot no it's not like stupid hot so like you could eat it and and not be afraid that you're not going to taste anything the rest of the day yeah well that's going to be today's video now if you like seeing product reviews like this take a look at our entire playlist which we're going to have linked right down here also make sure you take a look at our most recent video which you're going to find right over there but whether you head this way or you head this way don't forget to head this way subscribe to our channel click the little bell icon and that way every single time we upload a new video you'll be alerted to it until next time bye, bye.